My name is Christian Luis Sintos. My parents are Larry Vigil and Susan Sintos. I was born in Guymon, Oklahoma, but I moved to Clayton at the age of one. Wow. Yeah. That's awesome. And what year was that? That was about 2005, I'd say. Oh, what year were you born? Sorry, that's oh, what I meant. I was born in 2004. 2004. Are you 18 yet or just about? I turned 18 on February 27th. Ah! Well, happy late birthday. Thank you. What is your favorite song right now? Ooh, can I pick three? Sure. All right. Even more material for yeah. me. Yeah? I'm mostly like a rap, rock. I like hip hop, anything. Yeah. I listen to anything. So right now my favorite three songs are, I say, let's see, Shoot to Thrill by ACDC. Okay. Mm -hmm. I've been listening to that heavily right now. You uh, like it? Can't See Me by Tupac. Pretty cool classic song from yeah. the 90s. Yeah. And my third favorite song would probably be Runaway by Kanye West. Dude, all right, you've got a really nice rounded taste in music. I like it. All right, all right. dig it. Were you involved in any activities while you were in school? Oh man, a whole lot. <laughs> okay, tell me about it. All of them? Yeah, just tell me. What, right. What'd you do? So I was in class council my freshman through senior year. Nice. I've been in NHS for the past two years. I just turned oh. into the secretary for this past year. I have been in basketball as a manager my freshman year and sophomore year. Wow. But I was also a player for junior varsity my freshman, sophomore, and as a varsity player my senior year for a little bit. Nice. But yeah. Wow, so you were very involved. Oh, and I did the esports too. Oh, you working. did? Yeah. Oh yeah, obviously you're wearing it. Yeah. That's so cool. How did you guys do? We did pretty good. This is our first ever season and I think we were like really great. We we're like in the top five for all I think three of our games that we played, Rocket League, Super Smash Brothers, and Madden. Yeah. And Diego Aguilar, he won first place. I got to go with him. That's got this nice shirt. That is so cool. How much fun was that? It was great. Getting to participate at the state level on a new sport that yeah. the school introduced. That was neat. It was, was really, really exciting. Neat. That was I loved so cool. It. And it's cool that your senior year you get to kind of light light the way for the next next kids coming up throughout yeah that's really fun i'm passing the torch yeah really cool that you're a part of that history mm -hmm. for the school did you have a favorite subject or class while you're in school i'd say my favorite subject might be welding maybe, okay or maybe math i really love miss harris and i love mr evans out there the art or ag teacher yeah really yeah. great guy okay so if you had to pick one like you're stuck in that class for the rest of your your life which one Welding. Welding? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Choice. Okay, why? I loved it. He is a great teacher and he taught me a new skill that I think will be useful in my future. Which is? Just welding as a Oh, hobby. do you mean the yeah. welding itself? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Woo, I'm a, yep. Good little side hustle right there. Yeah. Who has been the most influential person in your life thus far? I think it'd be between my mother or my father. Okay. And they've just helped me teach like good morals my entire life they taught me how to like learn first and foremost one thing my dad used to tell me was uh you learn to read and you read to learn is there a teacher here that you're never gonna forget and why i know you already yeah. mentioned yeah. miss harris and mr evans man i'm not gonna forget any of these people yeah they're all really great Right. Freshman through senior year. And we've had so many changes and sure. people leaving and coming, but I think they're all going to stick with me. But most especially Mr. Evans, though. Mr. Evans. Yeah. yeah. So you think Clayton High School has just all around good teachers? I think we do right now. Yeah. It's been really. Do you have a favorite memory of your years at Clayton High School that you'd like to share with us? Man. Uh, so many memories. Yeah. I'll give two. One of them would probably be. Well, even freshman till even now, playing video games with my friends. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whether that be in school this year uh -huh. or until late nights, four or five in the morning. Oh, the jeez. Weekends, <laughs> summertime, anytime. Yeah. And another memory would probably be going to state. Yeah. That was really cool. It's my first year ever going there and I loved it. Yeah, that's so cool. Mm -hmm. that's so cool. Awesome. And if you could give any advice to the eighth graders that are coming up into high school next year, what advice would you give those kids? Do esports. No, I'm Do esports, no. yeah. <laughs> Keep the program going. <laughs> yeah. No, I think advice I give them would just be 
focus on your work, you know. Don't let distractions come into play and just stay dedicated and keep on doing your work. Yeah. And yeah. That's I think advice. that's it really. And what are your plans for next year? Man, I wanna go to college. I'm still deciding between Las Cruces, you know, NMSU, okay. or West Texas A&M Canyon. Uh -huh. Then after I graduate from either one of those places, I want to go to Texas Tech wow. for pharmacy. For pharmacy. Yeah. I want to major in biology. That's awesome. That's a huge degree. So you'll be in school for a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. That's I exciting. love school. You have to, right? Mm -hmm. And honestly, you never stop learning. So. Yeah. Whether you're actually in a physical school or not, you're always in some sort of school. Yes, ma'am. It's the best way to keep going. That's really cool. Well, yes, ma'am. Congratulations. If you could leave a final departing word or wish for either Clayton, New Mexico, or Clayton High School in general, what would you say? Man. Hmm. I think it'd be probably just like stay true what we have been doing especially for these past two years you know keep on bringing in great teachers uh, encourage the students to stay dedicated to the work and allow more extracurriculars to come in like esports for example or you know anything i think we're gonna have a marching band next year Yay. you know so i just want them to like keep on bringing in new stuff for the students to do so maybe we can you know get more student involvement i guess yeah. into the school activities why do you think student involvement is so important? Because it's what the school stands for, I think. Yeah. I think without it, I mean, the school just falls apart. The students are doing other stuff other than, you know, schoolwork and being dedicated onto their education, you know. And I think education is the primary focus that all students must have. Yeah, uh, that's awesome. All right. Well, congratulations on graduating one last time. and. We're so proud of you. Can't wait to see what you do with your future, where you go. And I hope when you come back to visit Clayton, you'll you'll stop in at your favorite radio station, 97.5 Calumex the Bear. Yes, ma'am. Listen <laughs> to it every day. All right, good. And I hope you'll you'll tell us hi because you know we'll we'll be following you. All right. All right. Thank you so much and good luck on your endeavors. All right, thank you, miss.